most beautiful poetry can be about simple things like a cat or a flower or rain. This poetry can come from anything with the stuff of revelation in it. Just don't let your poems be ordinary. Uh, I want to tell you a story. A story about... Um, so there's uh there, there's two guys and they and they're sitting around listening to um just to their to their records their CDs and stuff and they're listening and one guy is like hmm this music this music sucks dude cop cop a load of this music it sucks it sucks so bad man and then the other guy goes well where's your song who gives you the right to judge yeah and he goes you know what that's you did it you that's that's the perfect explanation and he goes what he says i'm gonna make my own song and it's gonna be better than any other song to ever be made in existence so this guy he he toils and he makes this song and it's the best song ever and and now, and he sh- and he goes to show the other guy the next day, and he he puts it on. He puts on the record. He puts he puts the record on Spotify, and uh, and and the other guy goes, "Wow, that's a pretty good song." And, <laughs> and um, yeah, and and then and then the they 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 play the record on Spotify and on on youtube and on um all the other internet sites and uh they and he it becomes the best song in the world it turns out by pure chance he created the best song in the world some guy and everybody loves him he becomes a huge celebrity and um everybody everybody worships him and he becomes the ruler of the earth because of his song he just has to play the song and everyone bends to his whim because he's like he owns the rights to the song so if you want to listen to the song you have to get his permission otherwise he'll sue you and nobody wants to get sued um yeah so he rules the world and everybody's he's a slave and he's uh his friend from the start of the story his best friend in the whole world he comes up to him he's he's been a slave in the mines for 50 years now he, he finally comes up he says my friend my brother my best buddy old mate uh don't like just don't just, just don't do it <laughs> don't be a dictator man don't be like don't rule the world don't be a dickhead and he looks down from his throne of like skulls and you know palm trees it, it's just palm trees because like it, it looks good he likes the way it looks um he looks down from his throne and he's like you know what you're the reason i made this song if it wasn't for you uh complaining about my whinging i would have never become the ruler of everything on earth ever so you know what i'm gonna listen to you i'm gonna stop i'm gonna stop being such a such a dictator you know being a real dictator that's what i that's what my brain just said to me um so yeah and then in the end the guy he's like listen i'm not gonna be a dictator anymore i'm gonna abolish the rights to this song i'm gonna everybody can listen to the song whenever they want and he he and then he goes back to his friend they get their old house back um you know economy's crippled every half the population's dead and if they're not dead they're dying but he's back in his uh, bedroom with his friend listening to I don't know uh, uh, maybe I don't know uh, all I can think of is um, <laughs> all I can think of is uh, Foo Fighters yeah so you know he's, he goes back to his house with his friend listen to some Foo Fighters and it's like you know what I learn a lot I learn a lot in in my time and you know what what's most important better than songs and everything friendship and that's and that's my story that's the story you need to hear goodbye 
You know I'm simply the best, the best, the best of you. And gonna give her the best, the best, the best of you.